back. How's everybody doing? I pray all is well with you and your family. I'm just stopping by for a moment to encourage you all out there to keep holding on, to keep trusting in the Lord. No matter what it's looking like, no matter what the circumstances are, continue to trust in the Lord. We know that the enemy wants us to be embarrassed. He wants us to fail. He wants us to doubt God. He wants us to do so many things to cause us to feel a certain way. But I encourage you today to keep holding on and keep trusting in the Lord. Even though you don't understand a lot of things, family, continue to trust in him. We already know what the word says to trust in the Lord with all thine heart and lean not into your own understanding. Yesterday, I went through so many trials. There were so many circumstances, so many things that came up against me it made me want to just throw in the towel. It made me want to quit, but I kept persevering. I kept hurtling over everything that the enemy was throwing my way, and I came out with the victory, and I'm grateful for that because it was just so easy for me to say, you know what, I'm not going to even deal with this today. Once again, so much was coming up against me, but I refused to take down, and I continued through everything that was happening, and God gave me victory over that thing. So I encourage you today to keep holding on no matter what it is that you are going through. The enemy wants to try and get the people of God to take down. But greater is God that is in you than he that is in the world. So continue to hold on people of God no matter what is coming your way. Learn to continue to hurdle over every obstacle that the enemy is trying to place in front of you. Amen. Amen. I pray that this quick message right here would encourage someone out there to keep holding on and keep trusting in the Lord. You all know that I love you with the love of Christ, and I will be back at that appointed time. And until then, you all stay blessed. Bye-bye.